चैप्टर नंबर एट इट इज क्लासेस एंड ऑब्जेक्ट्स इन जावा इट्स अ टेन मार्क चैप्टर सो लेट्स स्टार्ट मोस्ट टाइम पी मल्टीपल चॉइस क्वेश्चंस क्वेश्चन नंबर वन इज व्हेन द क्लास इज एग्जीक्यूटेड द डैश मेथड इज कॉल एंड द एप्लीकेशन रन्स एज अ नॉर्मल प्रोग्राम सो आंसर इज ए मेन question number 2 when the uh, when designing software the entire dash should be divided into the simpler components uh, that perform logically related task so answer is uh, d application question number 3 in java a class it is defined using dash keyword so answer is uh, b class then question number 4 it is uh, the keyword dash is used to create the object by allocating memory and its answer is d new question number 5 it is the dash means to initialize the newly created object so answer is a initialization question number 6 it is uh, a variable declare using class type can only store a dash to an object so answer is c reference question number 7 it is uh, there is a special portion of memory called the dash where the objects live answer is a heap then question number 8 it is uh, every dash has its own set of data so answer is d object question number 9 in java when there are no more needed the memory is uh, claim back for reuse so answer is d objects in object oriented programming languages creating an object is also called dash instantiation so answer is b object question number 11 just like class variable class dash can be derived using static keyword in front of the method definition so answer it is d method question number 12 variables defining inside methods or the blocks are called dash variables so answer is d it is called the local variable question number 13 it is uh, the word dash means many forms different forms of the methods with the same name so answer is a c polymorphism question number 14 it is uh, like other methods the constructor can also be overloaded so answer is c constructor question number 15 it is uh, the package statement has a dash syntax so syntax is uh, package in uh, bracket package name and the semicolon answer is a question number 16 it is dash provide the narrowest uh, visibility right so answer is b private question number 17 the dash methods are also known as getter so answer is a accessor method question number 18 dash methods are also known as setter answer is b mutator question number 19 it is a dash inherits all instance variables and methods from super class and it may have its own added variables and methods so answer is c it is called the sub class inherited question number 20 it is uh, constructors are not inherited in sub class answer is c <coughs> question number 21 in java to create a sub class keyword dash is used in the class definition so answer is a extends extends okay question number 22 java does not suppose support multiple dash so it is uh, not support the multiple inheritance question number 23 a sub class can be derived from only one super class 
ऑप्शन डी क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी फोर कंपोज कंपोजिशन एंड एग्रीगेशन एस्टाब्लिश डैश रिलेशनशिप बिटवीन क्लासेस राइट सो आंसर इज बी हैज अ रिलेशनशिप बिटवीन दैट क्लासेस क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी फाइव डैश मेंबर्स आर विजिबल ओनली विद इन अ क्लास वेर दे आर डिफाइन ऑप्शन बी प्राइवेट क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी सिक्स इट इज वाइल इट इज पॉसिबल टू यूज ओनली अ सिंपल क्लास इन अ डैश प्रोजेक्ट दिस इज नॉट अ गुड प्रैक्टिस फॉर लार्ज एप्लीकेशन सो आंसर इज ए जावा वॉट इज काइट एडिटर सो आंसर इज एस काइंटीला बेज टेक्स एडिटर क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी एट डैश आर डिफाइंड बाय वेरिएबल्स इन अ क्लास एंड सो आंसर इज डी एट्रीब्यूट्स क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी नाइन डैश अ डैश इज डिक्लेयर विथ द सिंटेक्स क्लास नेम एंड अ वेरिएबल नेम राइट सो बाय यूजिंग द डिक्लेरेशन सी ऑप्शन क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टी थ्री जीरो थर्टी देन अ डैश इज कॉल एंड इनिशियलाइज अ न्यूली क्रिएटेड ऑब्जेक्ट so answer is b constructor question number 31 with empty parenthesis uh, without arguments a uh, default dash is called constructor question number 32 it is java has a garbage collector that looks for unused dash and reclaim the memory that those objects are using answer is a objects question number 33 it is dash variables defined and uh, the attributes of an object answer is b instance 34 the dash can be invoked using the objects to access or modify the instance variables answer is c methods and question number 35 it is objects are created with the dash keyword right so here the new keyword is used answer is a question number 36 all instances of class are allocated memory in data structure called dash so answer is heap b option protection of the data is possible with the use of access modifiers answer is a then question number 38 the following code is dash system dot out dot print align in bracket r1 dot len semicolon complete okay so answer is b it is uh, this code is illegal and then question number 39 a class variable and the class methods can be accessed using a class name or dash variable right so answer is a reference question number 4040 variables are initialized with the default value and right? answer is a class right 41 which of the following defines attributes and the methods right so answer is a class then which of the following keyword is used to declare a class variables and the class methods right so answer is a static question number 43 which of the following operates operator creates an object and returns its reference and so answer is b new question number 44 which of the following method can be called without creating an instance of a class answer is b class method question number 45 which of the following refers more than one method having same name but the different parentheses para parameters sorry so answer is a overloaded methods question number 46 with method is invoked automatically with creation of an object so answer is b constructor question number 47 which of the following is a keyword used to refer a super class constructor in a sub class constructor so answer is a extends question number 48 which of the following is used to invoke an instance method in java so answer is b the name of the object dot and the name of the method right so answer 
is B. Question number 49, which of the following is uh, accessible by instance method? And so answer is B, all of the above. The last question, question number 50, it is uh, when methods in the superclass and the subclass have same name and signature, what are they called? Right, so they call inherited methods. 